I don't go that way, that's obvious. It launches timed and sticky grenades. Ooh! It's the big thing! I don't see a reason why not. If we blow the three coolant containers, this whole place will go up like a rocket. This place is crawling with the process. Be careful, Alias. Destroy A, B, and gold. What? Why is it gold? See, it would be alpha, beta, and then delta if they were going to use the... the the, what is it, the Greek or the Roman uh, labeling system for the alphabet? Yeah, fuck it. Hey! Door! Open the fuck up! be locked all you want, but I could be annoying uh, uh, more. That other door was locked. Yeah, you keep telling me that, that it's locked, game. Why do you say this? Also, why is the door locked? Never mind. I haven't found any of the containers. They must be somewhere near you. It'll be risky. But you'll have to exit the battle armor to handle the situation. Mm. I'll, I'll just shoot everything. How, how about that? Instead of me getting out of the, the battle mech, how about I just shoot everything? You're joking. Never mind. Uh. Uh. 
hold up. Must mean you found one of the containers. Two more to go. I don't think this weapon's named appropriately. Instead of calling it an anti-personnel, it should just be called a scatter grenade. The door closed and then he's suddenly he's right there at it. How did that happen? I still haven't found the main lab. Did they come out behind? Yes, yes they did. Listen, you. You, you, you little small robos are gonna stop this. And you're gonna do it very quickly. I'm gonna be very rude about it. Guessing that catwalk is the one I used before. I don't know why it has to blow up, but okay. Is that the little boy's room? Certainly make a mess in here. That last explosion knocked out the power in my area. You must have sabotaged the second container. There yep. should be one located in the main lab area. Boink. Now how did I hit a button with machine gun arms? Don't ask questions. I saw his skull pop up and then down. It was beautiful. Am I going the right Welcome way? Home, soldier. Look around. We were all reborn here. And here you will die. Can't get through here. Damn it. This place is getting unstable. I have no idea if that was the right thing, but fuck it. 
I'll take advantage of whatever the fuck happened. Yay, things are exploding! Someone ordered a fine cup of explodium. Or is it coarse? I, I don't know. Someone ordered a cup of explodium. I'm leaving and I'm taking this mech with me. Oh look, another mech. How grossly fortuitous. I'd like to introduce you to my nano elite. They are the ultimate warriors processed with none of the defects of previous generations. They make you obsolete. Um, I kind of turned them into little bits. They kind of don't exist anymore. You might want to bring some more. <laughs> Just saying. You're not gonna let me through there. Oh well. Not sorry. clue where I'm supposed to go now.
that's not opening. If I blow everything up enough, eventually I'll find out where to go. I knew it. Just blow everything up enough, I'll forget where the hell I am, and I'll find out where I'm supposed to be. reason not to. People's expectations, everyone's patience, mental stability. What the hell is that decapitated piece of a monkey doing there? one. Stop screaming. I don't care. If you think Reptus of me, imagine how tempted you look when I'm done with it. Hey, get back here. I'm not finished killing you. away from me.
Stop fucking EMP grenading me, you cunt! that in this particular version of the game I can't fucking get out of it Tell you what, you hang out up there, I'm gonna do this. Stop going back and forth. Just accept the inevitable. It'll make everything so much more easy. There. Finally, you're not gonna scream any anymore. Finally. What the fuck? Damn it! <laughs> you bitch! Shut up! I don't care! You're gonna get me screaming in a minute. If you think Reptus will be. Imagine how Tanjir would look when I'm done with her. No. Back here, you fucking pansy. Take your fucking punishment. Actually, take your fucking destruction. Making me chase you, you fucking pussy. Get your ass back here. Fucking EMP grenading me, you pieces of shit. I'm 
nearly fucking invincible. All it's doing is delaying the inevitable and pissing me off. Yeah, yeah, scream and whine about it. At least I say coherent fucking words made into coherent fucking sentences. Oh. Tasty. second time. get another gun out of him. Apparently I didn't. I'm on Molov. He's not getting away. Something's really wrong down there. What the hell did you do? I blew everything Cover up. Me, alias. No. You gotta get out of this thing. I'm trying you to kill you. Hold still. We must destroy it. No, we must not. Alias. Then the rest of the games can't statue. happen. On fire. He's got a ride waiting tops. Go, go, go! We have to destroy the cell. No, we do not. You die here. Please now. stop saying we do. Sopot's statue will be your tomb. The fuck did Try she go? Try hold your fire. You are shooting at me, you idiot. No. Shrike? Continue Pick firing. Shoot at everyone. Negative. Even me. Serious error, Molov. Shrike! Pick me up now, and I won't kill you. I have Molov cornered. Is this the thing? I hope Got so. a visual on Alias. He's almost to the hilt. Remember, Molov, we don't stop. We finish. You heroes better get up here before I save the world without you. I 
I ask you to sacrifice? If not for love of Sobat and the Commonwealth, then for your own sake. Today's sacrifice brings tomorrow's abundance. Goodbye, Alias! When does it blow the fuck up? There it blows the fuck up. We cannot tolerate these traitors in our midst. Oh, oh joy rapture. Look what you got yourself into. And I will rule the Commonwealth. No, you won't. Well, I guess that's the end of that. Alias was tried by the Red Faction government for the massacre in the Red Faction headquarters. Although the evidence of numerous murdered civilians was circumstantial, no one came forward to corroborate his version of events. He was convicted of murder and awaits execution. Tangier was rescued from the harbor by a passing garbage scout. She fell in love with the boat's captain, they married, and she lived happily ever after on the boat with her husband, six children, two dogs, and three cats. What the hell? Judged to be too unstable to be trusted, Shrike was thrown out of the Commonwealth by the Red Faction government. Eventually, he was shot down as he smuggled bootleg copies of electronic games into the Commonwealth from third world countries. Wait, he was smuggling bootleg copies of video games and they shot him down for that? That actually does make sense, because the way things are going, <laughs> pretty soon they're going to outlaw every damn thing that's fun. Well, I didn't think I would get through all of it in just ten short episodes, but I did. Can I get through these credits any faster. Yes. I can just press that button. Oh, that was fun. <sighs> fun and... Everything's changed since this game. I mean... Hell, everything's changed since Nintendo 64 graphics in general. Low polygons, low resolutions, it's fine. It's just that everything's changed. It's nice to play a game where the, the standards aren't set to the graphics. It's nice that it has a branched ending sequence that you can have like three different endings to. <laughs> <clears throat> and it's nice that uh, the extra game content called Cheats is in this game. Cre hey, fuck off! <laughs> Crazy bastard. Ah. Let's see. Gallery, concept art, squad, enemy, civilians, equipment. Mostly drawings. Very nice. This is when concept art being an extra thing in the game was just coming out, and it was mostly uh, 
pulled right off the animatic, the storyboard. Yeah, most of it wasn't colored back then. Nowadays, people want, like, full fucking rendered shit like that. But look, most of this, it's just line art. That was the concept art back then. It wasn't fully fleshed out shit, like professional artistry. You know, with color and cell shading and everything these days. But most of this is just line art. It's nice. It's nice to stroll down memory lane. Let's see how far. Hey, oh, these are actually in game models. Yeah. <laughs> Man turret. Oh yeah, that's one of the uh, rail trains that ran me over the very first time I played this game. Man, look at the ATV. The ATV's design has went through multiple iterations, but it has stayed as the ATV from Red Faction 2 to Gorilla, and even onwards into Armageddon. Uh, the military truck just went bye-bye. <laughs> the, the battle armor... That became its own fucking thing. It became a... almost a staple... of the gameplay. Um... In Red Fraction Armageddon, it pretty much was a standard issue thing in the game. But in, uh, Gorilla, the... the there was no real battle armor suit. I mean, you got to drive a loader mech that had melee sweeping attacks, but it didn't have, like, mounted machine guns and shit. Submarine went bye-bye. Those magnetic mines went bye-bye. <laughs> tanks, they got a little change, but tanks are tanks. Actually, yeah, they got really heavily changed from this design. But that tram, that that didn't stay in <laughs> that didn't stay in the next set of games. Gunships, they stayed. They had a couple of redesigns, but they stayed. Uh, fucking in Gorilla and Armageddon, I didn't see. No, nope, wait. In Gorilla, there weren't any boats that I remember, but in Armageddon, there was a boat. Dropship? Uh, no. Not in any of the later games that I know of. Turret stayed in. <laughs> Weapons got a bit of an overhaul. You still got things like the sniping rifle, uh, the rail gun. Even though its design isn't the same as in Red Faction 2, it's it's still in Gorilla and Armageddon. Speaking of, uh, check the prices to actually get the digital download for the uh, reverse compatibility. Well, not the reverse compatibility, but the digital download for uh, Xbox One. So I can go off and, and make a, uh, a little series of that for uh, Red Faction Armageddon. 
That's gonna be like thirty dollars. It it'd be nice to do that. It really would. The thing I don't want to do is have to re-unlock all the extra uh, so-called cheats in Armageddon all over again after I've done that on the 360. Anyway, well, that's it. Um, there's a lot of people I I know for an absolute. There's gonna be, there's just there's gonna be a lot of people who are gonna be like. No, I don't really like that kind of gameplay. It's too old, too low poly. It's it's not got any uh, ambience to it. It really doesn't have any ambience. I'm gonna be honest with you on that one. But there, for the very few niche people who enjoyed it, leave a like. The rest of you doesn't matter. Like or dislike, don't care. Subscribe or don't. Use the uh, PayPal or Patreon links in the description. E pick one. PayPal or Patreon. They're both there. Have fun with that. Till next time. Uh, the next thing I'm going to start on is redoing my uh, Red Faction Gorilla Remastered playlist. Yeah, I'm just going to re-upload completely fresh uh stream recorded stuff so till next time bye